Hi everyone. Okay, so today is October 6th. And yesterday we had my doctor appointment. So exciting. Um, I look like crap still because I just woke up and my nose is stuffy. So I think I'm getting a cold. But Justin's at work. And I'll just change the subject. <laughs> Justin's at work. And I'm just doing this video because he's at work and yeah. But so we went to the doctor appointment yesterday. Yesterday was a crazy day. I was worried. I don't know why. I was just like not worried but I was nervous a lot. And me and Justin was just bickering. Not, like, really fighting, fighting, but, like, bickering because, like, I was just so nervous. And, um, so we got there. They took us, uh, my appointment was until 1, and we got there early because, I don't know, Justin sometimes is too excited, like, mo probably, like, more excited than I am, and he wants to get there like two hours early or like an hour and a half early so he doesn't miss anything but yeah so we got there early again <clears throat> and plus I think he's worried about being late sometime and then if you're late you have to pay like $50 which is ridiculous but so I think that's another reason why too he wants to get there so early so, we get there, and, um, they weigh me, and I just weighed myself today, and I'm two pounds less than I was at the doctor yesterday, because, um, I think, because I ate, like, right before we went to the doctor, it could take some time, so it won't be extremely early there, you know, I'm trying not to tell Justin that, you know, we're killing some time, <laughs> but... So I ate after and then went to the doctor and it, it came up, I gained two pounds. So, but I just weighed myself this morning and it was two pounds less than it was at the doctor. So we, um, seeing the doctor, well, it wasn't the doctor I seen the first appointment. He was a guy, but this one was a girl, so I don't know what happened to him. So... Um, she went over my blood work and she's like, everything looks great. My body is making everything it should for a baby. So, we don't have to worry about that part. And, um, I have PCOS, but it's like a mild, like, form. Um, she, like, the reason why the doctor that I first seen last year in October, um, the one that was rude and saying I shouldn't have kids because I'm not old enough or rich enough. So, yeah, that one, the reason why she couldn't find that I had PCOS was because she did an ultrasound and she couldn't find any cyst. And I don't have, I don't have cyst or anything. I just have like mild forms of PCOS so it's not that bad so all my numbers were fine besides my thyroid and my vitamin D my vitamin D was low yeah a little low so I'm taking a vitamin D pill to bring that up and my thyroid was a little high but she said it wasn't too bad to be alarmed about so um yeah, and something else was um high and it has to get lower and I forgot what it's called. But I'm taking oh and um I'm taking metformin. And that's what she gave me to help me ovulate. But um I was supposed to take it yesterday and my husband or Justin wants to go pick it up. At the pharmacy and they won't give it to him they didn't even fill it because I was just gonna pay for it and they wouldn't even give it to him cuz they had to get like the okay from the doctor or whatever or like information from it 
for the insurance company to cover it so I can even get it so that's what I'm waiting on now I called three times already this morning and no answer so I can already see what kind of day it is gonna be I want to start this medicine like soon um cuz I there's this girl that I talked to she says she took it and she got pregnant the first month so I'm pretty sure it's gonna happen like fast but I I don't think it's gonna happen this month though like if I start it but I'm pretty like I'm not pretty sure but I have hope if it like it happens like the first month like of November because um the doctor also told me to not take Prevera this month until my period starts because I didn't have a period in September so she told me to hold it off and see if it starts by the end of this month but if not then start it up again which I know is not gonna freaking start I just know it and I don't want to take the pill on the day I'm supposed to Prevera on the day I'm supposed to but she told me not to and I just don't want to mess up something up so I'm just gonna freaking wait so I know it's not gonna happen this month but hopefully next one maybe that's a little too high or something but hopefully by December because our announcements and pregnancy announcements we already have it all um ready and everything we just have to get like boxes and or like a little baggie to put it in or something i have to figure something out to wrap it up in and that's what they're gonna do on christmas day because that's the day like my whole family is together and so that's um i have you know you know family they come on christmas day and that's where we see everybody really so that's a good time for us to do it so i hope by christmas we're pregnant and because i really want to do this announcement it's so cute and i have to order two things still and get the bags for it but i have to get those soon now i'm thinking about it so yeah if fingers crossed please you know give me good vibes and hopefully by December hopefully or I'm gonna have to think of something else to do I might do the same thing and just go to their house and tell them or something I don't know so yeah I'm excited I'm so excited I feel like every doctor appointment we get closer and closer and closer and closer. Like, so close. But, yeah. Oh, and the nursery tour, it's all the well, old nursery is done. But Justin wants to wait, which I kind of, like, understand. But I'm just anxious. Like, right now, it's set up, like, more kind of so if our baby is a boy... But if it's a girl, it's going to be totally, totally different. I have a different, well, it's going to be the same, like, print and everything. I'm just going to add some more stuff to it to make it look more girly. But it's going to be totally different. Because I got stuff to hang up still if it's a girl. I have, like, pictures hanging up on the wall. I have clock that matches the room hang up on the wall. And I want to get this um thing for over the crib it's gonna look amazing so it's gonna be totally different and he was just wants to wait till we find out the gender to show everybody but i don't know what we're gonna do i might i don't know i don't know but that's what the hold up on that but just like comment and sub to me you don't want to miss our journey there's hopefully a lot more to come and yeah i'm so excited i can't wait to be a mom i'm so excited okay talk to you guys later bye